All right, the last tip that I'm going to teach you guys is how to use the calculator to find the roots of an equation. So you can see that in the question on the left, we're being asked to find the solutions to the equation. That means that it's asking us to find the roots. So we're gonna go to menu, algebra, and we're gonna use the solver again. So now we're gonna type in our equation and we set it equal to zero because that's when we get the roots. And we also press, we also put in comma y at the end just so that it tells the calculator that we want it to solve for y. So I'm gonna press enter and here we get the roots. Now notice here that we'll have to rearrange these just a little bit to figure out which answer choice is correct. Notice that the first answer if we distribute the negative um, and remove the brackets, then it's going to be minus 5 over 6 minus the square root of 145 over 6. And the only answer option that includes that is answer choice B. So B is the right answer. All right. Well, that's it for, for this series of videos. Thank you guys for watching. I'm sure that the TI Inspire CX Cast is going to help you guys a ton on the test. If you guys have any questions or if you have any comments or ideas about what kind of SAT related videos you'd like to see, please let me know in the comments below and I'll make sure that I get back to you guys. So happy studying, best of luck on the test, and thank you guys for watching.